So welcome to our midweek special. We're at the EAG, which is the European uh, Amusement and Gaming Expo. Uh, so we're in London, we're in the Excel Centre, and this is our stand. This is day two, so we started Tuesday, today's Wednesday. I wanted to give you a quick view of what is on our stand. So we'll kick off with shuffleboard. So Josh is our temporary stand-in cameraman. Uh, so we've got two shuffleboards, and this has probably been the most interest we've had on the stand is in the shuffleboard, because it is a fantastic game. We've got two models on display, we've got the Brunswick Handover and we've got our signature uh, and this is the Marlow we've got on display here, is that right? Josh's modding, yeah brilliant, so those are two we've got on. Just following me round, then we've got our, so Paperboy's had a lot of love actually hasn't it? A lot of people come along and go, I can't believe you got a Paperboy. So we've got a Paperboy machine here and we had a guy come along yesterday who knew a secret way of getting a ridiculous high score on it, so I don't think you can just come and try and I don't know if it's going to be on that particular screen, but I'll show you separately. I'll do a separate video for how to get the high score on it, but it's something like a million and something that this guy got on there. There's a secret exit at the very end of the training ground, and you disappear off into a, like another area, and that's what we did. So come and have a look, Josh, just quickly before it goes. There we go. I think it's something like what is that? 11 million 386 thousand. I literally put his initials in it as well, although I was a bit annoyed he beat my high score. So, so that was Paperboy. Uh, then we've got Marvel vs Capcom. So this is one of our kind of replica cabinets, and this has got the genuine Capcom Marvel vs Capcom board in it. But it's a new cabinet, new buttons, new LCD screen, uh, which will just last a lot longer. And we get a lot of customers that actually want that rather than have the original thing. But you know, it, it's their own. You might want to have a proper one. You might want to have a, a recreation. What else we got? So we got the Joy Chinese 8 Ball table. So a lot of interest in this. Not a lot of people have seen the Joy Chinese 8 Ball table before. And this model is the Q7. Josh is good at North. Is that the Q7? Which is the one that's got the silver legs uh, on there. So that's the Joy Table. We've got the Jack Daniels Jukebox. We've got the Alien LE. Again, a lot of interest in Alien LE. First time this has actually been shown at a trade show. Uh, and yeah, a lot of interest in that. Great machine. Um, and what we've got the last two couple of bits. We've got. The signature Lincoln, uh, this is American pool table, coin operated, uh, and then we've got the Brassing, and this is the Victory 2. Again, a lot of interest in this from commercial operators wanting a tur tournament grade table that's been used in the Moscone Cup. The uh, World Pool Masters has been announced as well, that's taking part in Gibraltar in March, so you might have picked that up already on our Facebook page. But look out for that, and that's the table that's going to be used in the World Pool Masters there. So there's a quick rundown for you. Uh, as I say, quick midweek, midweek special, back on Friday as normal. So thanks a lot.